wonderful studio. <laughs> and uh, I'm here to talk to you about things like DLC. That's right. I've been trying to stay out of the whole DLC versus expansion packs versus included content crop controversy for so long, but right now I've got to say something. What I say isn't going to be palatable, it's not going to be favorable, and it won't be popular. But it is the truth. And the truth of the matter is, is that it is your choice, no matter what, when it comes to buying the stuff, if it gets included, if everything. It's all your choice. You have the choice to say, I want it, or I don't want it. If you don't want it, don't get it. If you don't get it, then it shows up on the balance sheet of the company who makes it and says, oh, geez, we waste a lot of cash and time. So let's scrap it. Believe, believe it or not, companies do notice. When a company only makes one quarter from what they make, you know, one quarter back what it costs to actually make this stuff, then it's not, you know, it doesn't make sense to them to continue on doing this. You know, too many games have yet to have a sequel. Why? Because they didn't make back enough money from what it costs to make the game. So they say, hey, we can't even pay for the game we made. Why are we going to fork out cash creating a sequel or creating downloadable content, expansion packs, yada, 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 okay? You don't want it, don't buy it. Trust me. That says more to them than a bunch of angry emails. Now, I'm going to talk to you about included content that they're forcing you to buy. Yes, I agree 100%. That is wrong. It's like, you know, you look at some of those old cartridge-based games where if you, if you hit a number of points, they say, Congratulations, you just unlocked, you know, a whole new stage and you unlocked a new character and you unlocked a bunch of new moves that you couldn't do before. That was wonderful. But if they were to make you pay for that, you know, like those old wrestling games where they say, Congratulations, you just unlocked uh, Bret Hart. But you've got to pay $10 if you want to use them. Well, you know what? I wouldn't be using Bret Hart. That's for, you know, damn sure. Uh, you know, because I ain't paying $10 to, you know, continue playing a game that I already spent X number of dollars buying in the first place. That's why I don't play EverQuest. I don't play Warcraft. And I don't play any of these games that I gotta pay money to keep going with. That makes no damn sense to me. However, I will buy the occasional expansion pack. But that's different because it's my choice. My choice. Not them telling me, you got to do this. And if I do happen to get a game that says, hey, guess what? Because uh, we're going to make it that you need to buy a license to play it. And you got to go along. you got to keep paying in order to play. Well, you know what? I ain't playing that game anymore. And I'll take that game back to the fucking store. That's what I'm going to do. Because that also says a lot of money, returns, getting returned games, getting, you know, lack of sales, returned games, that says more than angry emails. That says more than people outside with signs saying, I don't want to pay for my DLC. One thing you gotta really remember about DLC is it takes money to make it. It takes people, it takes ideas, it takes a lot, okay, to make this DLC, which is why it does cost a lot of money, okay? You might not think that, you know, some of the DLC is worth it, but you know what? The people who make the DLC think it's pretty damn worth it. They work their ass off to make it, and they hope and pray that you buy it. You know, and they certainly don't do it for free. They don't do it for shits and giggles or something to put on a resume. They do it to make money to feed their families. Okay, now I'm not here to say buy it because it's good for the economy or buy it because it helps to pay for someone's job. No, buy it because you want it, because you like it and you say, yes, I'm going to get that one. And you buy it and you put it in your game, yeah. But if the game says you need, you know, 10 extra bucks to play,